Television is a, is a complex industry, a machine some might say, and what it does is it takes decent, ordinary people such as yourselves and strips everything that's good out of them until they're just the empty husk of a man um, that you might meet in the street who's a little bitter and uh, yeah, that's what television is. Okay. Good evening and welcome to part one of our celebration of 20 years of community television in Melbourne and Geelong. Tonight we attempt to present some of Channel 31's story spanning the last two decades. This isn't a best of show because that would be an impossible task. From the polished gems to the rough cut diamonds. And the personal stories and diverse worldviews from a wide range of cultures and backgrounds. We've searched exhaustively. Well, we looked really hard. For as much footage as we could find, it hasn't been easy. And like lost episodes of classic Doctor Who, many moments over Channel 31's history have been lost. Our independent producers scattered to all corners of time and space, well, Frankston and Glenn Waverley at least. <laughs> For many, their first experimental steps into producing television are the kinds of embarrassing skeletons they'd prefer to leave buried deep in their backyards. And for some, those skeletons are about to be dug up. Attempts were made to reach out to as many of our producers as possible, old and new, just to give them fair warning. We hope if you're out there watching tonight and you see a bit of your old show, you know it's because your efforts were inseparable from the larger Channel 31 story. And if your show doesn't show up here, we're sorry. We know we could have spent another six months tracking more shows down, opening boxes filled with DVDs and digital tape, filtering through unlabeled hard drives in dusty bungalows. And yet we still wouldn't be doing community television in Melbourne and Geelong justice. We've made a lot of TV over the years. So without further ado, let's blow off the cobwebs and take a look back. In some cases, to a time before I was born. Mm. A time before high def and digital and entertainment even existed. Uh, in fact, here's segment one in my hot little hands. A, that's a little unwound. That's fine. That's, uh, does anyone know how to work when I just go to... Mm. I just wind, just wind it and we'll, we'll play it. It'll be fine. I've got a pencil or... The, the wrong one anyway, so it's... The Prime Minister has abandoned plans for a half a million dollar yeah, dining room extension. Out to test the fire system or repeat, it is only a test, thank you. And the Channel 31 <laughs> fire system is about to be tested. <laughs> Showers and 16 degrees today. <laughs> Chris, you are the consummate professional. <laughs> oh. That is sensational. Because that work. happened once before last year, it did. and we were just stunned mullets. We had no idea what to do. Because you know what happens next is the sirens about to come. Yeah, Bendel has, <laughs> on, has only just raised his own stakes there. That was exceptional. It was exceptional work. For anyone who missed it, that was the announcement <laughs> saying that we're about to test the fire system, um, the fire alarms here at Channel 31, which is it's good to know. It's good to know yeah. that we're safe. It, you know, it really is. If the joint Cats is fine, we will not be burnt to a crisp. <laughs> Which is an out of out of um, out of the realms of possibility because yesterday we've got a really old photocopier here. I was yeah. using it yesterday morning and we all went, Can someone smell toast? Oh no, uh, it's the photocopier. See, that's not good. Can you hear me, Bernie? Uh, yes, Rove, I can hear you. Uh, how's your sex life been, mate? It's been fantastic. All the celebrities have arrived here at the Crown Casino. Matt LeBlanc, all of them. Let's have a look at some of the footage that I've got here for you, Rove. Rex, get your shit together. 
40 years of Logies and still no Channel 31 nomination. Do you think that's justice? Is it fair? It is stuffed. This industry is stuffed. John. The last few years you've been wearing you've been wearing black shirts the last couple of years. Why have you made the big change to the white shirt? What a what a stunning question. It sounds like you're struck with Logie fever. Oh, Logie fever. It's I mean is this bigger than the Academies? No, it's not. No, but it's good though. Well there it is. We're heading inside now to get Bernie. pissed rove. Bernie. I'll uh Bernie. what was that? Is can't, it true? Hear you? Is it true you're not wearing any underpants? Exactly. That's <laughs> right, yeah. We'll be inside now. Um, Bernie Carpet reporting for the loft on channel thirty one. Back to you. How do you find that with like your face with your Facebook people? You just like, you know, just finished East Link. Lol. Good <laughs> line. <laughs> and welcome to another episode of Country Cousins. Now, what have we on today, Christine? Oh, today's a great day. It's so good it almost makes one feel like dancing, hey? I've read so many uh, reports, viewers, about Father Bob uh, and happy birthday, you turned 75. 75 on the 14th, whenever that is. Oh, and, and you look 65, Father Bob. Well, I feel 95. When the light flashes and the signal is given, unleash hell. Hold the line! Hold! Stay with me. Hold the line. Charge! This is surely not a permanent appointment. Well, we'll have to see about that. What are you, criticising my tea without even tasting it? <laughs> yes, <laughs> yes, I am. He's on a two-week yeah. trial. Two-week exactly. trial. Okay. We'll see what happens. Are you romantic? Yeah, oh, I am the romanticest bloke that you could ever come across. Prove it. Very gentleman. <laughs> um, you look... You look... Um, you look better than the sun setting on the waterfalls of springtime, baby. We've had a, a huge request. For... <laughs> 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 that, better not, that better not stink. Oh, oh, no. uh, <laughs> Mr. Stink. Oh, oh, anyway. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Bring your feet apart, bring your arms above your head, bend forward, bring your left hand to your right ankle, look up, come back up and bring your arms down. Greg D said to me, because you're trying to go digital, I'm not allowed to swear anymore. Would that be correct? After, after nine o'clock is okay, Jess. After nine o'clock so I can That's fantastic. Hi, my name's Romano and you're watching Blokes World. Well, there you go. That was it. The best of Channel 31. Now, for the rest of the hour, all the highlights of your favourite community television show, Fish Camp. Oh, I heard a rumour that's coming back. It is? Yes, but not the way that you remember it. Mm. Coming up in the rest of tonight's show, the highlights continue. Oh, maybe some of my old show. Maybe some of mine. And maybe some of theirs, plus heaps more. <laughs> <laughs>